so pissed off in this world, man. The one thing that only thing gets me mad nowadays is that so many people die with untapped potential because they think that someone else is fucking better than them. And they were born, you know, not with the greatest tools. You don't need shit. You need the ability to fucking grind your ass into a fine fucking powder. And when you're in that fine powder, find a way to build that motherfucker back up repeatedly. And it's possible. Anyway, I called my dad that night and I said, I, I, I think I need to pack it in. I need to go get a job and just, I'm, this success thing is not, it's not for people like us. And my dad goes, Eddie, you don't have to decide you're never gonna quit. He goes, just don't quit for one more day. See how you feel tomorrow. I go, Dad, he goes, just, just don't do it for one more day. And I got up the next day and I still wanted to quit, but not quite as much. And then I went one more day and one more day and I found myself about 30 days later, I didn't want to quit anymore. And thank God the one more I did was, I went one more day without quitting. And I'm so grateful I didn't quit on my dream. Oh, and those feelings of failure are so hard. They're so hard to get over and they, they overwhelm people and some people can't get past them. And then every time some new thing comes up, when you have to rise to the occasion, you have to perform, you think about that time you failed and mm. it fucks your head up, man. You think I'm a fucking loser. I can't do this. I'm going to fail. I'm going to fuck up, you know, like yeah. bombing. Like how many times have you had a bad set and you're like, God damn it. I suck at comedy. I can't do this. I can't do this. I yeah. suck at comedy. It's 